All right. So, mini game time. Gotta remember Switch just to warm myself up. I think I already saved, but I'm just doing it again. <clears throat> hey, thank you, Judex. Oh, look, everybody else is out here with us. Freezing to death. You know, I've been thinking. Seeing a place like this makes you realize how awesome nature is. But if anyone ever told me to live here, I'd tell them to, well, you know. <laughs> I tell you one thing, Hing, though. If I did have to live here, I'd change things around here, making it better. I guess Midgar or is the total opposite of this place. When you think of it that way, the Shinra don't seem so bad. <laughs> What's the matter? Now that you're actually at a mountain and you're seeing real avalanches. Are you not so fond of avalanches, Barrett? Yeah, I know. I know Ricky likes Stardew. I'm just saying, like, just I'm I've watched his gameplay of it. It looks like an it just looks like an endless list of tasks and chores and and management of things. It's just not really my type of game. It doesn't tell a particular story as far as I can tell. Like the combat is relatively rudimentary. There's not so much skill involved in playing Stardew. It's it's a very chill game. Like, I know there's some story in it, but, like, it's not that kind of story. <laughs> From what I could see, anyway. Um... I'm gonna say 50-50 on that one, Judex. There's some skill in this. It's not the highest skill ceiling I've ever encountered, that's for sure. Like, it's not hard, but... Trust me. Try playing this game. You'll, you'll understand what I'm talking about when you try to learn how to menu. And also, like, equipping the right stuff at the right time. It's a pretty low skill ceiling for sure, but it, there's something. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess you could technically say that about Stardew, I suppose. I don't know. We'll secure the route. You come up later. Meanwhile, Kate Sith does not require warming. Thirty six degrees. Oh, that's a little chilly. <laughs> Do I tap it? Do I hold it? Boy, imagine if climbing a mountain was actually this easy in real life. You know, just warm your just just you know just warm yourself up a little bit, and then you can totally climb this ridiculously cold mountain with freezing temperatures. It's no problem. Just warm yourself up a little. You can climb Mount Everest. It's no big deal. Uh, you know what would be really great, though? Just use Ifrit. Or maybe these guys are so weak that I don't need to bother. Never mind! Cloud just counterattacked him to death. Oh, okay. It's colder than that outside right now? Yeah. <laughs> That's another thing, man. If only mountains were just, you know... 
38 degrees. That's a, that's all. Uh, uh, oh, there we go. I have to press OK to climb. Cellular device. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> Judex immediately. Uh oh. Let's warm back up. How's it going, cellular? Tell me, what do you think of, uh, oh, you're playing Donkey Kong Country on the Wii. Hey, there's a solid game right there. Good old Donkey Kong Country on the Wii. I assume you're talking returns. Yeah, Donkey Kong Country Returns is a fantastic game. For sure. Uh... Be afraid. Just get them all. Do we even need to do anything else? I hope not. Bolt 3. We have Bolt 3. Uh... What do you think of, um... What do you think of Pokemon Let's Go Eevee? For when I eventually move on to Pokemon. I was thinking, like, I'm gonna do all the different gens. Like, all the different gens of Pokemon. But I was like, I wanna do the original Gen 1 because it has all the really funny broken mechanics that I grew up with, which are really fun. But then I was like, oh, but I should do the remakes, though, because they look nicer. And then I was like, well, what's the most recent remake of Kanto? And the most recent remake of Kanto by far is, of course, Let's Go Eevee. And no, not Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee. <laughs> because Eevee is definitely better than Pikachu. Pikachu's a specialist, Eevee is a generalist. Um... So, I was thinking of doing that for my Gen 1 thing, and I was like, I was wondering what you guys thought of that, would think of that, and I'm, I'm not, another thing I'm not sure of is when I'm gonna do it, because I'm actually thinking I might want to do Breath of the Wild again soon, and so I'm like, do I want to do Breath of the Wild after this game, or do I want to do, or Leaf, or Tifa will not get to use her limit break. Um, or do I want to do Pokemon next? Like, I'm not sure. What do you guys want to see next? Do you guys want to see Pokemon or Breath of the Wild next? Javelin, cool. Let's use the bull, just because we can. <laughs> no. Yes! Yes! There it is! There's the suplex. Well! Boy, that just makes the summon kind of pointless, doesn't it? I didn't realize Tifa was going to just kind of go first and obliterate everything. Okay, well, we could enjoy this really long animation. Um... Hmm, okay. Alright, we might do, uh, we might do Let's Go Eevee first then. We might do that. Pokemon over Breath of the Wild? 
Aurora, really? Wait a minute. Aurora? Are you saying that's your opinion? Wait a minute. You would rather see Let's Go Eevee rather than Breath of the Wild? Uh, huh. Like, that doesn't sound like you. Some, uh... Considering how many times you've done Breath of the Wild. Okay, fine. All right. Well, all right, so... My plan is this. As soon as this game's over, we're going to take a quick pit stop to do Zero Four. Uh, Mega Man Zero Four is a game I've been waiting to kind of get to, so I'm probably going to do that first. But that's only going to take... When will this game be over? That's a good question, Judix. I don't know. But we're going to do 0-4 next. That'll probably take like one to two streams. That's like not very long. And then... <laughs> then we'll do... Um, then we'll do, I guess, Let's Go Eevee then. I guess we'll just do that. Uh, after that, though, I'm probably just going to be like, no, we're doing Breath of the Wild again. <laughs> probably. And then after that, I don't know. But it sounds to me like I at least have my next game lined up after zero four. Fine, let's do let's do let's go let's go Eevee then. Again, we're definitely not going to do Pikachu, we're going to do Eevee because generalist is better choice. It's okay. He doesn't know. And I don't mind him asking. I have no idea where, which direction I'm supposed to go to get out of here. There we go. What is this? Push the rock? Do we push it, guys? I think we push it. Strength. Huh? Isn't that the path that brings us back up? No, that isn't the path that brings us back up. Oh, it clears the way for us. I get it. Okay. I see. Also, lots of green down below us. Looks like the life stream is down below us right now. Just attack things. These enemies are so weak, we can just attack them. Yeah, I don't see it as a problem. Okay. By all means. No, no, it's not rude. You can ask. I mean, never mind. Honestly, Judex, you come and you watch. Like, you're, you're always here watching my stuff anyway. Like, if you want to ask when a certain game's over, you're more than welcome to. Can I climb that? Like, how do I get up there? What's... What's the deal? Oh, look! A back attack! Excellent. Uh... No. Well, 
three. Smack him. If that doesn't work, fire three. There we go. Yeah, if you want to ask when a game is going to end, you're more than welcome to. Like, some people come because of the game and not because of the streamer, and that's fine. That's totally fair. Like, I know a guy named Meta X who he came and he watched me play through, like, like the Zero series, but then, like, as soon as I was done, he left because he was only really there for the game. And he was cool, but, like... He was just there for the game. But, like, I really appreciate you coming no matter what game I play. Like, like that's awesome. Like, I seriously appreciate that. Ifrit, just get him. I'm not really looking forward to the motion controls, but, uh... Other than that... Wow, Ifrit didn't kill these guys. No, but that sure did. Hey, and I think the same about you. Man, thanks so much for coming. I'll try to make it to one of your streams someday. <laughs> if I ever get up in time with enough time to spare. Alright, now we can go through here. And this will take us around here. We need to heal up badly. Time to heal. Uh, Barret. I'm actually saving. Actually, kind of saving up my limit breaks if I can here. that work? Wow. We got some strong spells now. Alright. Oh, here we are. Okay, we're, now we're at the top of this area. This area looks kind of gorgeous. Like, I like this. Great. Oh, look at... Oh, no, we're back to this again. Warm up. Quick. Do the I gotta pee dance. And then get into a fight. <laughs> Immediately. Okay. Loud. Hit him with Bahamut. Sure. Why not? We have so much mana. There's no reason why not. Why did it attack its friend? Why did the enemy just attack... Yeah, I know. Like, they, I love how they have no warm clothing, but it really doesn't matter. Because we're just so broken that we can just, apparently, just, like, dance real, real, real quick and raise our body temperature and we're just good. We can climb this super dangerous mountain. I was just saying that earlier. Like, man, if only it worked like that in real life. I'm a cl climb Mount Everest. I'm not dressed properly at all. But if I just, you know, warm up real fast, I'll make it and it'll be no problem. Wait, where's the climbing spot? What? My nuts? Where's the climbing spot? Oh, there we go. Okay. Can I go sideways? Is that a choice? Is there a fork here? Oh, there is a fork here. Uh, go to the right? Yeah, sure, go to the right. Body temperature lowering fast, though. Gotta make sure we keep an eye on that. 
Warm up at every opportunity. Go on up, go on up. Keep a going. Oh my gosh, yeah. If I press it really, really fast, we warm up a lot. Okay, that's good. Um, um, where is the next spot to climb? Next spot to climb? Hello? Uh, what? What? Am I crazy? Yeah, if a dragon blasted the mountainside, they wouldn't be on the mountain anymore. That's true. That's very true. Not every fork is going to take me forward. Oh, no. I see. Well. Here we go. Thank you for letting me know about that, Avalon. I appreciate it. That seems unfortunate. Go to the right. Go up. Okay, as nice as this game looks for 1997, I really do wish that we had like some kind of more clear indication of... Like, the the boundaries of where we can walk and where we can't. That's a dead end. Oh, no. I wonder how they're going to do this in Remake. This is going to be interesting to see when we finally get to, like, the third part of Remake. How are they going to do the ice and snow areas? Implying they're going to do this in Remake. I mean, I think they will. Why would you... Why? Well, or something like this. It won't be the same. They're not going to go off on some dumb tangent nobody that played this game cares about. I guess. <laughs> I'm actually on the development team for Remake. I gets bitten by a radioactive spider, shoots webs. They can climb up the mountain that way. Uh huh. Uh huh. This looks like a Colt 3 situation. Actually, we'll just use escape next time. Here too, because we can. Ice is not going to be particularly great in here, probably. Don't tell anybody I said that. I think that's the story behind, behind Monster Hunter Rise, probably. <laughs> that story does sound familiar. Got an elixir! These holes look suspicious. Like, I feel like I'm probably supposed to go down them, maybe. Uh. Bolt 3. Fire 3. Just going to trust that that's enough. Don't be silly. That's Spider Man. Really? I had no idea. Okay. Here's a save point. The position of this save point. Oh. Fury. Mm. The position of this save point makes me think that uh, soon 
we're going to be encountering a boss. I want to check these holes. Are we supposed to jump down these? No? No, that's water in them, maybe? Uh, no, okay, we can't go down those. There's a couple of different pads here. Um, Fury means we take more damage, but we build our limit meter way faster. Oh, Meteor Rain hits everything? Oh, okay. Yeah, this game has a few more mechanics that Pokemon doesn't have. Just a few. When are we gonna be over this mountain? Oh, Fury also lowers accuracy and damage output. Oh, what is this? Um, what? in what have we just found regen please ferret demi 2 actually what the heck is this thing odin it odin own it yeah this is some Petey Piranha stuff. Odin, smack it! Get out of here! What do you mean, run? Let's just kill it! We have we have OP summons, M tentacles. Yeah, we have OP summons, Aurora. We are fearless. We have no reason to run away. That thing is so hard to kill in other games. Well, it's just yeah, just use a summon on it. <laughs> Clearly. Uh, yeah, we do need some ethers, though. We're sort of starting to run out of mana here. Okay, fire armlet. Ooh, okay. Oh! Oh yes, this is where we fight the icicles. Cloud. Um yeah. Bolt three. Tifa. Fire three. Barret. Limit break. Uh oh. I think Cloud's been silenced though. So. Oh no, we wasted a turn. Or it doesn't know how to kill Petey Piranha. Imagine. <laughs> Petey Piranha's not nearly as... is not actually that tough to kill. Um... It's cracked! What? What's it doing? It's cracking. We win? We cracked it! We're f why are we fighting icicles in the first place? Yeah, Aurora's not really a, uh... Jump down to room below? No? Yeah, um, Aurora's not really a, a, uh, Mario fan. Uh, 
Enemy skill. Trying. Fire. Three. And then just attack, I guess. Ah. Silly bat silencing me. Have fire. Uh, Monka S, that's an emote, but you need a uh, better Twitch TV for it. Why do we have to wait for this? Yeah. I considered getting better Twitch TV, but honestly, even if I were to put emotes on better Twitch TV, uh, my viewers would have to have it in order to be able to view those emotes anyway, so. Because of that, I decided just to not bother. But I did consider it at one point. Well, okay, fine. This time we'll just attack. Since they're gonna silence us. Uh, keep swinging. Yes, I mean, it's just a bunch of bats every time. Oh! Let's go ahead and have, let's get some cure off here. defend. Let's go ahead and cure to the party. Then let's have Cloud defend again. Like, we're literally, literally just gonna skip over to Tifa's turn here. She will use Fire 3 on it, and that will end this. Yeah, Zubats are annoying no matter where they are. One more to go, till we get whatever treasure's in there. All right. Fire three. If I just cast fire three, will that just be the end of it? I certainly hope so. What do the vampire fangs do? Yeah, it looks like that's it. Yep. I was streaming Galaxy and... Streaming Galaxy earlier and it took me two hours to get ten stars to finish the game. Wow. I don't, man, it's been so long since I've played Galaxy. Oh yeah, that, no, I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking about, that one. Yeah, the one where the star's in the ball and it's like a golf course, but you're like riding on the ball and you have to use motion controls. Oh man. I know what you're talking about.
Maybe I don't want to jump down to the room below just yet. Maybe I want to go back and check the other path. Yeah, it was designed for the Wiimote. Doesn't work on the Joy-Cons? Ugh. These pure random battles, like Avalon said it earlier. I don't mind saying it again. These pure random battles... Like, I feel like Pokemon does it better where, like, certain areas you can get random battles. But not every area. And also, we need, like, repels and lures and things in this game. We need some way to control the battles a bit. Speed source, okay. I have not used any of my sources. I mean, that's, honestly, that's no different from Pokemon if you think about it. Like, these battles being a snooze fest, just random battles in Pokemon can often be that way, too. They can just be... just kind of battles that are uninteresting, because they're like, maybe the enemy you encountered are just kind of, is just kind of underleveled. Yeah, but you can't avoid these, and that's kind of bad. enough. I can always use this. If it's somehow not enough. Hey, see you later, Cellular. Thank you so much for coming by, man. I appreciate you. Okay. Uh, yeah, but I opened that. Assuming it's the one you're... Assuming we're thinking of the same thing. You know what? Magic hammer. Uh... Bear it. I'm with trying. Wish I could give some magic to Tifa, though. Hey! How's it going, BB man? Doing all right. That's probably what did it. That's what made us. That's what put us into fury mode. Doing okay. Just getting lost in snowstorms and such. You know, store and cover up. Hey, there we go. Store and cover level ups. That's awesome. Just getting lost in snowstorms, fighting some icicles, you know. Final Fantasy stuff. So many of these, I have no reason not to use them. I can go higher? There's higher I can go? Go right. I hope. Go up, I think.
Press the button really fast to warm up. I think, and then go this way. I have no idea where we're going. Also, I didn't I didn't drop down to that room down below either. Like, why is there so many different directions to go? Go up. There's so many different directions to go. I want to explore them all, but I have no idea. Get what? I have no idea what direction on the controller to hold sometimes. Um <laughs> yeah, maybe not do the VPN to America then. Oh, this thing again. Um, Barrett. Uh, yeah, let's just try it, I guess. Cloud limit break. Smack it. Try to steal from it, actually. Tifa, does that thing have anything to steal? Yeah, we can see the your messages, though. Man, died so easily. Can't believe you were afraid of this thing, Aurora. So yeah, we did, uh, we did earlier... Uh, BB Man, you you missed the you missed the cutscene where Aerith dies. Sephiroth shows us just how evil he really is. That thing's nasty when you're lower level. Yeah. I wonder if I'm still over leveled at this point. Probably am. It's only air. It's not like it's cloud. <laughs> so heartless. Yeah. First time seeing it was like... First time seeing it was like, yeah, that's the feels. Uh, yeah, let's just do that. Save our game. Still have no idea where we're going. Like, this mountain has been very, very long. Try to steal from it. Barret. Summon the bull. I did find... Yeah. BB Man, isn't this one of the ones that you mentioned? A long time... A while back? Like, this summon right here? With the really long animation? I found this in the the sleeping forest when I went in there. Who do I want in Smash? Err. Hmm. Who do I want in Smash that they don't already have? Honestly, some more Mega Man characters would be great. Like, give me Zero. Sora. Um... <laughs> That probably won't happen, but it'd be quite the thing if it did. Uh, what in the world? Huh? What? What's going on? Eek help, and then a giant, and then one of the, one of those hooded guys leaped out, and now everything's shaking. And now a boss? What's going on? Hey, it's another Genova form. Um, I'm gonna say immediately, let's go with Big Guard. And then uh, let's go with... Yeah, be careful, it's a trap. It sure is. Um, hmm. I think Bahamut. Let's start hitting him with our best. 
try stealing from it again. Yeah, those could be interesting choices. Paper Mario, Dr. Robotnik, Ed Eggman, or Wily? Possibly. Now see, it would be really nice is if Tifa could just end this with a suplex. Barrett, um, um, doing anymore do I do this now is this a good one I don't know ah I'm going all over the place I don't know what to do cure two cloud I mean it pro I mean honestly with this game being the way it is I am expecting this thing to just die So limit break. Cool. I'm expecting this thing to die really easily. It's got the cool boss music, but so far, like, 90% of the bosses in Final Fantasy VII have died very easily. They never seem to last long enough to survive all my summons. to steal. Oh, okay, well, death blow on that then. Um, Barret. It, it, that actually worked. Uh, let's go for another big guard, huh? Don't want anything weird going on. Let's try stealing from the other head again. Cloud, uh, I don't know. Honestly, let's hit it with bio. Get Knights of the Round is a difficult task. You better be look it up on look up a video of it. Just plan on doing chocobo reading. Not really. Um, I don't know. Just attack. Uh, I still dislike sometimes how this game won't just let me read chat in the middle of battle because like the boss will keep attacking if I the boss will just keep attacking if I don't keep playing and it's just like what if I want to chill for a second and consider my options you know Pokemon will let me consider my options all right fine how about Odin again and then one of my limit breaks, yeah. If it doesn't die before then. Tifa still, yeah, I'm gonna use Tifa summons now, I think. Glad we have magic barrier. Uh, Barret, yeah, sure, pull up. Oh, free? No. Just keep using try and we know that works. Yeah, as long as I'm in a command menu. I guess that's true. I could do that. Yeah. But why should it? Yeah, like, like that's the question. Why should it only pause when I'm in a command menu? Like, why can't I just pause whenever I want? Don't think Shiva would be a good idea, but Ramu might be. Yeah, BB Man, I'm thinking about doing Let's Go Eevee next. Oh, we killed one head. After 04. We're gonna do 04 and then we're probably gonna do uh, Let's Go Eevee next.
Oh my goodness, that was... Okay. That was dangerous. Have you, pl have you ever played any Pokemon game? Uh... I... Is it just going to... That's not fair. What? Is it just going to kill everybody? No, no, it didn't kill everyone. Oh! Oh, it just did that before dying. Oh, great. Cool. So, Cloud's the only one who gets any ex experience from that. Wow. All right. Gotta love it when enemies have a death attack. And it's just like, oh, I'm dead. But before I die, I'm gonna go ahead and just like, you know, knock out half your party so they don't get any experience from me. Cool. Awesome game design. Gotta love that. Gotta love that. Good thing I have so many Phoenix Downs. Probably should have just used elixirs, but I don't know. Good old self-destruct, yeah, yeah. Except it's not self-destruct, like in Pokemon, it's... Because in, in Pokemon, self-destruct kills the Pokemon that used it. But like, in this game, what? Do I just keep pressing up? Yeah, I guess I just keep holding up. Uh, but in this game, it's just like... I already went to the trouble of killing and then it self-destructs. It's like... I guess it would be the equivalent of it... Like having a focus sash and an automatic self-destruct... When it would have died. And we're here. Cutscene time. Whoa. We found something in... Yeah, we found something rather impressive. Yeah, it's Great Bay Temple. <laughs> we found the giant crater. old crater. Something fell out of the sky and crashed down here, leaving a scar on the planet. So all this energy is gathered right here for the planet to heal itself. Sephiroth took that energy and is trying to use Meteor. Next time that wound won't be so small. Genova's crater. Yep. Hey, Cellular. Welcome back. Uh, it's a bat. It's a pincer. On whatever that is. Uh. Trine? Okay. Just bought a DS for $20. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hey, that's cool. Oh, we get nothing for that? What? Well, I mean, wow, that was a whole lot of nothing that just happened. Back to Sephiroth. Okay. That's cool. Uh, what games do you have for it, Cellular? Got any good games for it? Going after Sephiroth, aren't you? I mean, we have been this whole time. I've lost a lot because of Sephiroth. Let's go. Why are we... Why was this moment necessary? I feel like it really wasn't, but okay. No idea. Oh, it's self-destructed. That's why no items. Summon Neo Bahamut. Hey! Got Animal Crossing. 
Pokemon Black and Black 2, Pokemon Diamond. Just needed to get a DS. Ah, okay. Yeah, I see. Yeah, your old one broke. Aw. Oh. I get that feeling. Used it so much, loved it so much, and... And it finally broke. Ugh. Oh, it, can it did manage to infuriate Cloud, though. Phase 2 of Bahamut. Oh, yeah, no, no, this is not the end of the game. No, we're... We're still only about two-thirds of the way in. We still have a large amount of game left. Um... I said that last Friday. No, I'm pretty sure last Friday I said we were about half. Now we're about two-thirds. Because we've definitely passed disc two. So disc two is behind us. So we're on the final disc here. But we've only just started it. Aerith only just died this stream. So... Uh, I guess... I guess we're fine, but we need that save point. No! Oh, game! Urgh! Sometimes perspective really screws you. Uh, save the game. I'm actually fine with Cloud getting his limit breaks faster. However, there is something importance to consider here and I think that it's I think we're almost to the point where Cloud's gonna get taken out of the party or is that still a bit later is that a bit later still I wonder oh look it's the airship we're totally going to take later so I finally found you wow who knew if you just actually took this airship the whole time it'd be really easy yeah, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, ha, ha, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, laughing. Enough laughing. Mm -hmm. This is incredible. Man, both... These two... Like, S Scarlet and Heidegger both love to laugh. This is the promised land the president has been had been searching for. Somehow we haven't found it before today. But I'll be the one who gets it. Sorry, old man. Hojo. <laughs> that land is no one's. It's where the reunion will take place. They will all gather here. I wonder if we'll see Sephiroth. We need to cross when the wind is calm or we'll get swept off. When this fuzzy gif goes away, that's when we need to cross. And enemies from behind. What? We've been attacked by primates. They're hitting us with Japanese letters. They have bad mouths, apparently. Yeah, they're, ba they're bad mouthing me. Yeah, they're throwing unknowns at me. These poor black hooded guys are just dying left and right. Um, 
Smoke three. Fire three. Ice three. Just hit them all with all the threes. All the threes. Going on and on about reunion. Receive Kaiser Knuckle. Ooh, what's this? Hmm, interesting. I'm st I mean, it's no, I'm not going to use that. But interesting. Huh. Still ahead of us. Lots and lots of walking. There's another whirlwindy gif in the background repeating over and over. We're almost a dot on the screen at this point. Um, what even are these things? Also, we should try Morph. You know what? I think we're gonna try out Morph here. If it, yeah, well, I mean, if they don't die. But we need to actually try Morph out. I've actually not used it. I equipped it to level it up. Um, walk up to the gift carefully. Oh. Did I mistime that? I guess. I guess I mistimed that. One single enemy stole a high potion. Not even a very strong enemy. But we can just use that high potion we just got, I guess. Ah, we made it through. Haha. -ha. There we go. Just had to time it just so. And there we there we are. Sephiroth finally. This is the end for all of you. And he's cutting down all of the people that were chasing after him. Trying to go to the reunion. This is the end. You're right. This is the end of this body's usefulness. He disappeared? He might still be nearby. <laughs> you know, I've actually noticed... Hold on. Our purpose is to deliver the black materia to our master. Okay, it's not auto tech. It's not auto scrolling. Good. I have noticed that if somebody rolls high and you try to roll immediately after them, your odds of getting something low are higher than if you wait until somebody else rolls something low and then you roll, then you'll probably get something higher. That's not always. That's not always true, but I've noticed that seems to be the pattern. Whenever it gives out a low, whenever it gives out a low number, it has a it has a much greater tendency of giving out a higher number after that. At least that's what I noticed on Ricky's channel. Our 
he got away. Well... Okay. <laughs> I mean, you can. I ask that you not. Or at least keep it to a minimum. But you can. Those who carry Genova cells... Sephiroth. What? Hey, 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 what? What's going on? There he is! What? Did it just seriously knock all three of us out? Hey guys, thanks for watching. This is where most people tell you to like, comment, and subscribe. And while I would appreciate you doing all that, if you enjoyed my content, come check me out on Twitch at twitch.tv slash trinfinitex so you can watch and chat with me while I make these. I'm a family-friendly streamer, so everybody's welcome. Throw me a follow on Twitch and Twitter so you can get notifications when I go live. Links will be down in the description. Have a wonderful day, and I look forward to meeting you.